friends. Fancy a little walk with me around the estate where I live? Welcome to Castle Vale. Let me show you around. I would like you to meet my friend Chloe. She lives nearby and we used to go to the same primary school. We put on our warm clothes and decided to go to the conservation area just across the road. The conservation area is a place where people are trying to preserve wildlife, keeping it green and natural. It is not very green at the moment though. Not very often we are having snow in this country. Sometimes winter passes without any snow. This winter we were lucky. We had snow before Christmas and three days of snow in March. We got beautiful meadows where in the summertime we can see lots of animals and many different types of birds. We are walking around the allotments. This is a community place where local people can grow their own fruits and vegetables. Understandably, it is very deserted at the moment. It is also the home for the Community Environmental Trust, a small charity organisation which looks after this area. Every week they are taking children from local schools and introduce them to nature. When I was in primary school, we called it forest schools and loved it very much. Lots of the local people take their dogs here for a walk and free run. The major attraction to the local people is the horses. At the edge of the conservation area, there are stables where these horses live. Horses are out and about in the fields all year round. Lots of people with little children come to see the horses and we also stop to give them a stroke and some nuts. They are very friendly but sometimes argue with each other for food which people bring them. This little white horsey is the favourite of all Castle Vale's children. His name is Willow. He's very sweet but unfortunately, the big horses are much quicker to get to the visitors to receive some treats than him. Castle Vale's conservation area is the best place for bird watching. We were lucky to see at least three different types this time. This beautiful bird is called a thrush. And this one is a robin. Aren't they beautiful? Before we went back home, we stopped at a small area called the hills. We don't know why they built these strange waves on the ground, but when we were little, I used to play there with Chloe when we had snow. Well, it is about time for us to go home. Say goodbye to each other and say goodbye to you. See you soon. Goodbye.